Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that's another. Well, that's what you're gonna do with the person giving you magic. Yeah, I know, <laughs> but still, I just like, I couldn't resist. Basically, he's like, "What does this bidding do, my master?" And the other thing gives her information, and she's like, "I served you, please." And I responded back, "Kiss ass." <laughs> That's not really dialogue. That's just. Hmm. <laughs> but Didi's well pleased with you. Or thing. I don't hmm. know. Alright. So I look at the E statue. That's uh, seven. Dang it. Okay. You recognize it as one of the pirate lords of old, but you cannot recognize the name. Can I discern whether it's male or female? Male. It has Damn. a longer coat, but there is no weapon attached to his side at all. Or anywhere near there. <sighs> okay, I walk to the long end of the hall where there's the single one uh, R and R. <laughs> and I just look at that one. Please be high. You think it'd be the R, think it'd be the R but it'd really be a C. Please, can I just re-roll? Because I was an yeah. eight. Okay. I'm getting nothing but low rolls today. Um, that's a crack. Yeah. Hey guys, are we doing movie night tonight? Or just nah. like watching a random thing? Or just no, because I'm leaving. Okay. I gotta go back to Lansing. Well, are I'll probably hang out. Probably hang out. Yeah. Okay. Oh, what, what'd you roll? That's a total of 16 to look at the R statue. The R is none other than Siegfried Rogers, the pirate lord and pinnacle of pirate success, standing there at the end of the hallway, slightly larger statue than most people, with a well guarded sarcophagus next to it. Well guarded, eh? Rolling perception on the sarcophagus. 8 plus 5, 13. It is surrounded and written on by a what language is. you do not understand. Well, I ain't touching that. I didn't use brush room. Um, I'd rather not do it in here. <laughs> Alright. What about the Q one just to the left? Ooh, 16. So 21 on the Q statue. As you look up, I need the music. The music just completes it. Why are you not working now? You've been... There you go. Why do you keep looking out there? It's trying to bug me. I, I don't <laughs> know either. I think like there's like ten people behind me like watching. But you look up, there's like the entire row of people. Yeah. <laughs> you recognize that the lady standing in front of you is none other than the queen of pirates herself. Standing there in the long trench coat that she has, of course, set a cutlass pointed outward, hmm. outward, and then standing next to the bottom of the statue is the sarcophagus enclosed, and likewise, like uh, same, like written in a language I can't understand. No, similar no. to Wang Z's. Okay. You just so. Brave proctor, ancient pirate. <laughs> I can't even believe it. Like, <laughs> yeah, I'll do you one better. The black katana I got from Wang Z. I'm gonna use that to pry open this sarcophagus. Are you serious? <laughs> Roll a strength check. <laughs> and I don't know, throw a D8 in there. So. I think I'll become the captain after this session. Uh, <laughs> no, I think I'll just I'll be somewhat respectful and just use my bare hands. Okay. So. No honor among thieves. All right. My next character is going to be all five. It's uh, another 21. Okay. So you're what? First you open oh, it up, character. and there is the Look garb of their, what you think is the cutlass of her personal weapon. Well, no, it wasn't so much As honor, well as, as right a piece of parchment. I didn't care about honor. I cared about what was right. Written My down. sense of honor may not be But right the body is the there, hmm. fully intact. He discovered the... Queen of the Pirates, too. Oh. The Queen's Herald? Oh. <laughs> the tomb. Alright, so, uh, just go over that again. Sorry. It just you find the, the skeleton cutlass. there, fully dressed. The cutlass that she probably used in her life buried hmm. next to her. Some bags of silver again. 
but also a piece of parchment put on the inside of her mouth, rolled up. <laughs> well, with one hand I grab the bags of silver, with the other one I delicately try and get the paper out. You do. All right. So first off, how many silver? Uh, again, three bags of fifty. All right. Okay. So and I'm having so visions of uh, I'm having visions of the first Pirates of the Caribbean. Mm -hmm. As Tech Gold. Mm -hmm. Well, hey, at least I can't die. <laughs> That's what they thought at the beginning. All I have to do is keep track of those silver and then slit my uh, palm, but... Now, which one did you You know, I actually... Do? I really don't like adding things until after a fact, yeah. and that's a really good idea, and I wish I did that, but unfortunately... All, right. all the so, curses. <laughs> you all right. get a curse. You get a curse. You get a curse. I already have a curse! <laughs> so, I... Again with the music. All right, this is acting. All right. Anybody have a creepy tomb? Music. Uh, As I go to the bathroom, the opera opera music. Boom, All right. Ba, 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 ba. All right. Hold on. I'll be right back. That was fun playing with you, man. Yeah. All right. Are you okay with your character? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Cool. I'm just double checking because I seem to have been like. Ah! <laughs> no, no, no. It, it, it worked out. It's a little close to Cad Week than I was thinking, yeah. but it'll work out. Yeah, that's good to hear. It's individualist. Now, technically, your device is on. <laughs> no, <laughs> darn these ads. Okay, let me just. Uh. Yeah, the fact downstairs is off limits currently. <laughs> What's downstairs? It's off limits. The downstairs is off limits. Cause we have to use a. It's not off limits. We have to use the elevator if we want to go down there. Okay. Why is it off limits? Uh, the fix, the doing maintenance on the stairs. Ah, okay. Uh, I've got some Shadow of the Colossus music, but it doesn't really fit. That might fit, you guys, with my battle. I'm really curious about this stuff. I'm really curious about this piece of paper. I'm very curious about what curse he's gonna get. Okay. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and be respectful and s well, what slam. Is the sarcophagi lids back down. Um, what's the cutlass of the woman that you just got? I didn't take it. Was it a cutlass? Well, was it a cutlass? It was a cutlass, so, but I'm not taking it. Can I have that so, cutlass? Maybe. And, and the cousin, you know, the uh, the queen, the pirates, her thing. He thinks that the, um, the queen's herald might be chasing us after this point. It's pirate's life for me! <laughs> well, if I'm gonna die, I might as well go down and die in a place of glory, right? But yeah, I'm, I mean, Faye's gonna go actually speak with Dead on the corpse to talk to her, possibly. Because it's actually up to the person if they want to talk or not. But, hmm. Okay. Like, after. after helping It's still a personality, even after they die. <laughs> I mean, there is a lot of. Think this music is good? It's a little action oriented. Faye is definitely not an atheist. See. <laughs> She's fully aware of the effects of the gods. Or at least outer planar beings that are very powerful. What about this one? You know, thinking about That's all better, the religion yeah. stuff yeah. though, I probably might be like most of the people. I would love to see somebody who could pull off a paladin on a ship. Hmm. On a pirate ship. Well, I feel like my character wouldn't know a lot about religion at all, really. Yeah, right. and, so, um, what are you doing with the scroll? That no, that's not a difference. So I just feel like it's more of a general population. And look at it. Or if I see that magic user that's not somebody I know, I will probably assume they're a cleric. All right. That's you that's see an wrong. X. Yeah, but yeah, that is a map very that. similar to. No, I get the... my powers from my god. I mean, like uh, I know you're not a cleric. I'm, I'm a cleric. I'm a cleric of something. Oh. Not well. I don't I have guess to say stereotypical. Uh, uh, right. You Next. worship a god that's about stuff. <laughs> you don't know Dang much it. about my god. Exactly. Neither does she. <laughs> yeah, but 
She doesn't go around saying, hey, I'm not a traditional cleric. Um, okay, um, you see the map is pointed to the Caspian Sea. Capion. The Caspian Sea. Capion. Crunchitize me, Capion. On A12 of the Capian Sea, there's an X mark. And it says. Let me try to make this as perfect as possible. So basically, everything is all in that picture. Here be with the Dave Queen. It's a good thing we're already going to Capian. Still. Obviously, I can't medic. Take that cutlass and give it some actually. Yeah, because I'm assuming they brought out the ghost queen of pirates. No, well, just I'm assuming. I mean, yeah. I'm gonna. Right. Around some more. Just assuming that cutlass has magical properties yeah. that are better than mine. It has magical properties they probably want. Right. Yeah. Well, I'm keeping the black katana. Probably has magical. I'm keeping that katana for myself. It doesn't matter. I'm not proficient <laughs> in that. But, unless it's a camel, that's not a camel. So, let's see. Hmm. Well, I... Yeah, after I'm done, I think I'll just close the sarcophagi lids again. I probably did, did the yeah. same with Wang Zi. Just Wait, so you can't believe that it's his name. That's like his actual pirate name, but like the way we use it today. Anyway, continue. Uh, I'm gonna put little check marks by ones that I've at least looked at. All right. I just wanted to stand up for a bit. Oh, okay. No, that's fine. I might do the same thing here in a couple seconds. You've been sitting for a while. All right. So. And I'm still dodging a dime. All right. Directly behind me, the A statue. Perception eight. Unless I can, I just like yeah, you can re-roll. You're not hurting anything. Not three. Three. It's not taking ten. Yeah. It just means you basically get ten. All right. Well, that's eleven. So sixteen for A. You notice that this is. The Robin Hood of the sea, by some would call him, or the fairy tale of the sea. So like, these are all dead pirates. Bed dead, the first pirate. The first people to claim this territory. Hmm. It's Adun, the name is Adun Seem Resbunar. You notice that the man standing there is very well looking looks very happy, unlike the other ones standing there imposing themselves. But you notice that the sarcophagus is bursted open. Walk forward and just peer in. There's no body, and it looks as though it's been bursted from the inside out. Alright, no body, no effects, no gold. Nope. Alright. Well, just saunter on over to the bee statue. I wonder how many you're gonna rob before Mason says, That's it, I'm killing you. Alright, 18 for B. What the? I thought I heard something. Something from you? Yes. I'm just like static and stuff. Yeah. You yeah, ever heard of. Uh, the Queen's Herald? No. Yes, I have. It's like. Or your com your computer will just get possessed and start playing a random soundtrack that you have on your computer. I have a smart computer every other day. It's like it's like I know it happened to the nostalgia critic where his there would be no programs open, but it would play the intro theme of the Ghostbusters. And then a buddy of mine had it where again no programs were open, but it would play the opening theme to Naruto. The most trolly virus. Ever. 
Now you just need to do that with a Rick roll, and then everything the internet wants to so accomplish what did you roll has been accomplished. I forgot, I think it was an 18? Yeah. You're Bold, naturally. Baldassar Casa. Cosa. Right. Grand standing figure, great sword on his back, typical pirate lord as well. But it constantly in the shadow of Siegfried Rogers. Hmm. All right. And for his sarcophagus, sixteen again. Okay. Sixteen. Yep. That opens it. Okay. So what's inside? Inside would be that great sword. The typical three bags of silver. You think they might be like a tribute or something? Mm. Like that from the crew or the first <laughs> mate or something. Oh. Uh... <laughs> you greedy bastard. Hey, I spent almost every coin I had getting my uh, getting my scimitar enchanted. That's so. the only type of gold that you'll be earning that I'm going to ask not to take <laughs> a share of. All right. I assume you so. take those. See the great sword. Do I want to take the great sword? Yeah. I mean, I wouldn't really have use for it. The Might katana well is basically a great sword, just better. Might as well desecrate all the tombs. And I already have the katana, so I mean, eh. I'm proficient in great sword, but I'm by no means going to use it. Well, you you guys could come back in here if there's enough time. So. I'm just gonna just close it down and let's see. Did you take the silver? Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. Took the silver. And. The fact that tens of thousands of people refuse to send me their money is sickening. Grow up. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. And let's have a look at statue E. So. 11. You recognize that is Eustace the monk. A pirate monk? A monk. Alright. All right. A very so. interesting story, actually. I can tell you guys afterwards. Okay. Alright. Well, you might have to tell me later, because, yeah. Because I'll be gone after this. Yeah. So, uh. The. So I'm assuming none of the other sarcophagi have the runes or traps on them. Yeah. Alright. So, let's check his sarcophagus. Strength, 18. Still on slug. Which sarcophagus was that? Uh, E, just to lift it open. Okay, you lift it open, there's just a 50 silver. Just 50? 50? 50 silver. Oh, so 150. Do do do. <laughs> All right, close back down. G. Just for posterity's sake, I'm erasing and rewriting my character location. Okay. So. Perception, 10. Okay. You notice that that is G? Yeah. Godaki Mishad. Try to... You recognize that this is the guy who tried to start his own empire, but eventually failed. Hmm. And open the sarcophagus. That was on a crack. Eighteen. Okay, so you make it open. You see inside is a some old schematics, probably written down of past plans, the typical silver, and then a hammer. Or a earthbreaker. Um, I'm just going to take the silver and nothing else. You know, you can take the schematics. Maybe Catholic would enjoy those. Well, yeah, I'll take the... Let me write those down. Just don't tell me you got them. Just don't tell Captain where you got them from. <laughs> so, schematics of what's this guy's name again? Godeki Michel. Yeah. Uh.
Alright. Technically, I'm not writing down their names because I'm recording this. And so I just uh, take those, slam it down, and. J. Perception. 22. Alright. J. Yep. Jean Fleury. Flamboyant pirate lord, as you can probably tell by the look of his statue, but other than that, he was just he was probably one of the deadliest duelists on the sea at his time. Hmm. Alright. Open up the sarcophagus. Ooh. I ain't gonna try again. Not really in combat. Alright, 18. Can you make it? Yeah. Um, you see in there the rapier and the usual gold. I'll take the rapier. Um, Pirate Lord Jean. All right, plus one fifty. <laughs> All right. So. All right. Yeah. Close that, and then perception on the P statue. Eight. So re-rolling. Look, if it's lower than ten, then I always re-roll. All right. Sixteen. For which statue? What? What statue? The P one. Pedro Menedes de Avis. Typical Sudan privateer, daring, dashing, a daring, dastardly, dastardly elf. <coughs> Johnny Depp. <laughs> All right. Opening. Kind yeah. of a dick. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna. But don't, but don't judge him because of that. <laughs> Can I just like take ten on all the perceptions and then take twenty for all the openings of Sir Top Guy? There's only like one more left, so. Take twenty is literally taking twenty minutes to, oh, to do what the action Never is. mind. So Alright, so yeah, it's I still have the S statue and the T statue. And this one, so just opening up the sarcophagi. Natural twenty. Nice. Just hurt. Yep. So I'm getting stronger. Turns out it was actually from a movie set, and it's made of styrofoam. <laughs> Yay, you've been tricked! <laughs> Is this really an Abeloff tomb? <laughs> You're all enslaved. Woo, tune in next week! <laughs> um, you find in there a... Not really anything interesting, but the usual silver. Alright. All right, next, S. Percep yeah, I'm just going to take 10 on the perception. And that's to roll a fake 10. Yeah. So. Uh, Samuel Axe is the last guy. Typically, he has a large battle axe portrayed in the statue like his namesake, as he says. Take Facebook. Mm. Yes. All right. So... Uh, opening up that, yeah, natural 15, strength plus right. 5, so 20. Uh, you see that battle axe in there, it actually covers up the body, it's absolutely huge, but, um, I'm going to use it with something. The huge. Dang. <laughs> Alright. Well, I'm taking that. You said it was a great axe? Right. Of. And I'm, I'm just writing his name down. What's his name again? Samuel Axe. Battle Axe of Samuel Axe. Yeah. Woo! 
Yeah. All right. So, <laughs> last... Yeah. <laughs> last one, the T statue, right where I came in. Just to take Thomas Payne. Oh, oh yeah. I already... But but, I, yeah, but I didn't open up the <laughs> sarcophagus. Sorry. All right, open it up. 22. Three. Two. Scrolls. And gold. And the usual silver. Scroll. And gold? Scroll, Scroll and silver. Alright. Scroll. So. Four. Alright. Uh. I'll, okay, I'll open, open up one of the scrolls and see if I can uh, discern anything. Nope. Uh. You know what? I feel kind of bad leaving Faye with that guy, so I'm just gonna take all of the scrolls and just give them to her. Just here's your Christmas bonus. <laughs> My Christmas she, bonus. She's gonna be going back to the um the corpses to at least talk to Thomas Payne. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Or all of them. Or all of them. Especially to do with the scrolls. <sighs> But yeah, Evan wouldn't necessarily know that one. Step, bro. Step, bro. Oh my gosh, okay. Do so you know Zant? This is totally. No, I can tell you guys that later. Evan's on a time limit. So. Mm-hmm. Alright, well, I'm done. Um. Okay, roll a will save. Me? Yes, you. Bro, <laughs> <laughs> well, you just robbed. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. We just rolled. Oh, not well. You did rob this ones. Oh yeah, so ten. You roll off the ten pirate lords that are ancient. <laughs> I think you should fail this will save. <laughs> they would fail Where'd this will it? save. I haven't rolled yet. Okay. Okay. Sorry. Mm. I just said something funny. All right. I. Excuse me. All right. The lucky ones. I'll roll for you. You get a ten. No, no, no. Okay. Yeah, everybody roll, I'll take the highest one. <laughs> and please be a natural 20, please be a natural 20. Yes! Oh, natural 20! Oh, oh, you son of a gun! <laughs> Alright, you walk out alive. So, so I, 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 get to the, I get to the entrance, or exit, where I came in. Just flash for a second. Huh. Then walk out. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> oftentimes you can't tell if something's trying to intrude in your mind or something like that. What would have happened? Ooh. Oh, fever Be dreams. haunted in your dreams by the ghosts of the pirate lords. <laughs> That's what I was going to have happen to you. If I was a real douche, I'd make you roll 12 times for every grave you rob. But 12 times for everyone? He robbed 10 graves to be. Yeah, 10 but- graves. I'm sorry. And keep rolling them. <laughs> no, that's true. Okay. Uh, um, yeah, my turn. Is there a way we could do s- no? Oh, no just, okay. Let's go to the combat with the golem. Da, da, um, da, the golem? Da, 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 da. That's, what that's what it is? Oops. Yeah, it's a flesh golem. Surprise! <laughs> um, yeah, so you left off. It's oh, no, his turn. You want to make it over there. Roll a d6. You roll d3. I don't know. That's how many rounds it's going to take for you guys to show up. Alright. Because you obviously hear his noise of the fighting. Four would be a two. So, two All right. Rounds. Okay. Three. Alrighty. So, alrighty, so can I the map you? Yeah. Alright. I'm going to ask a question. Well, actually, you move first. Let's see your questions first. No. Although, I do have a question no. about that. What, you what want are the squares in the middle of that? No, I accidentally started more music. Sorry. Oh. All right, you can continue your music. What are the squares? Sorry, I'm just like, getting everything oh, organized okay. here. Um, what's the what? The squares in the middle of that room. The six squares. What, what? In the bottom? Like, what are the... Are they pillars going all the way up to the ceiling? Oh, yeah, they're like hallway catacombs. They're like more... Ca- it's like another wall. Oh, okay. Yeah. Are, is it like, can I climb on top of them? Or does it just go all the way up to the roof? They go all the way up. Dang it. All right. He's doing some slam attacks. You ready for this? Mm, I guess. What did you roll, Evan? Dang, he's not going to do it. Okay, so you're there in two rounds. You are there in three three rounds. 
Okay, cool. I'm opening the door just so we get a little bit of cross yeah. breeze.